but I, I, uh, I just want to thank uh, him for the kind words and recognize Judge Gilbert as well. Uh, both of these men have been my mentors and now colleagues and friends for many years. Um, speaking of public service, Judge Gilbert is the true public servant. Um, he's not an SIU grad, but he's uh, served in many capacities um, now as the chair of the Board of Trustees, and he devotes a lot of hours to SIU, and uh, he doesn't have to do that. He doesn't, he's a retired judge, so uh, he's basically working for free, carrying a full caseload, helping us, so that is true public service, and we appreciate that. Pat Murphy did hire me very pregnant uh, 24 years ago, and um, was supportive through two more children that I had in my career. Um, and I learned a lot from him in the 11 years that we worked together on a daily basis. Um, no one could ever take Pat Murphy's place, but I try to emulate many of the things I learned from him and watching him as a judge. Fairness, uh, practicality, and a strong work ethic. Um, and certainly, just on a personal level, he changed my outlook on life in many ways. So to SIU, I too want to just thank everyone, um, the uh, president, the chancellor, everyone who's here today um, for the support of the law school, especially uh, Dean Davidson and everyone who made this day happen. Um, I think it's great, uh, and, and I thank the entire law school family for uh, everyone who supports the school in any ways, whether that's being a mentor, hiring externs, hiring graduates, volunteering for things like moot court, it all makes the law school uh, stronger. So this, this new uh, wall of fame, I think, is a great testament uh, to the legal education that's available here in beautiful Southern Illinois. Um, and I think uh, it just highlights the special nature of SIU and uh, strengthens our reputation. Um, so we've talked about public service, that's what judges are, um, and it's more than the honor of becoming a judge however you got there, whatever the process was, um, but it is uh, public service to the community. Um, it's often usually not glamorous. Uh, the pay <laughs> isn't what people make uh, practicing um, in uh, big law firms. And it can be hard at times. The decisions we make in an afternoon can impact many people for the rest of their life, and it's not something that you can take easy. But it is rewarding at the end of the day. So when I said, why do I have to speak after Pat Murphy, I was told that they would give kind of the past perspective and I could talk about the future of the judiciary. Well, when I graduated from law school here in 1993, every judge, in the Southern District of Illinois, every district judge, magistrate judge, and bankruptcy judge was a white man. Now, fast forward, we now have four women, including two district judges, one magistrate judge, one bankruptcy judge. We've had two African-American judges, district judge, magistrate judge. We currently have one Asian-American judge and we have one member of the LGBTQ community. So we've made great progress. And why is that important? Because diversity means so much. I think the bench should represent the community and that uh, diversity brings different perspectives, which helps us all grow. And when litigants come into the courtroom, they see a bench that more represents um, the community at large. So I hope that that continues. Um, I, I, I hope that SIU continues uh, strong and I have every reason to believe it will and that our, we'll just have more and more judges on that wall so maybe we have to take up another one. So thank you all for having me here today. I'm standing between you and food so thank you. <laughs>